Hello there, all you wonderful people. This is Andre the Game Idea Guy. Thank you for lending me your time and your ear and listening to another idea that will work out on the Wii U. And that is Metroid Prime Hunters. Now, before you get agitated with me and say, well, that's an old game, Andre. You've been talking about a lot of old games. Why are you talking about so many old games? This would be appropriate, especially for this year. Because it's the 30th anniversary of Metroid, as well as The Legend of Zelda 1. That's why I did The Legend of Zelda 1 last week. But, um... <clears throat> Metroid Prime Hunters... I won, I think, it's a game that has not really been appreciated very well. Secondly, I... If... If... The rewards that I saw for my, my Nintendo for Japan are... Actually happening... Metroid Prime Hunters will actually be a downloadable for the 3DS eShop. And then now you're saying, why are you asking for this for the Wii U then if it's going to be on the 3DS eShop? Very simple. Very, very simple thing here. Now, put it on the 3DS eShop, put it on the Wii U eShop, but then give these games the online play that they used to have. Just hook them to the current Nintendo network. That's what what I would say would have to be done with this. Put it on the, the current Nintendo network that we know of, their, their current online infrastructure. I, I could get I can get that they couldn't put it they couldn't like keep online up for the old DS and the Wii and there are fan servers out there for some games that you can play on and there's hacks that will allow you to get on to them. But <clears throat> This would be something that could could be run through Nintendo. Like even though their network has been given chaff a lot for not being the best, it actually is pretty stable. Like I have rarely, if ever, dropped from any online game I'm playing. I've rarely done it, and the few times it has happened, it's been something with my network. So it's not necessarily on Nintendo side that it has happened. Which makes me think they could put this game out there on the Wii U and the 3DS, give them cross-platform play, but put them out as virtual console titles. Look at what they're doing with uh, with Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow. They have these games have features that were not originally tied to the original game. Uh, you can put Pokemon in the Pokebank and transfer them up to later generations of games. Why couldn't we do that? Why shouldn't we be able to do that with a game like Metroid Prime Hunters? Why shouldn't Nintendo be able to do that? To me, it's a possibility. Now, <clears throat> then you'll probably be thinking, well, what about people who have the physical copy and they play it on their 3DS? I think, honestly, if you play it on, the, if you play any copy of it on the 3DS, physical or if they, if if that rumor is true. What it was rumored to be on their eShop, if that is true, then it would have to be, it definitely would be something with that particular hardware. We both know that the Wii U and the 3DS share a, a common network, which is why I say this would be possible to do on the Wii U and the 3DS to have online play, and then everybody who has a version of this game who is playing it either on the 3DS or on the Wii U can play with each other online. Because part of the story of this game is tied to the online play. So to put it out without that availability kind of demeans the experience. You don't get to experience the game fully without that online connectivity. And oddly enough, this game actually had voice chat and things like that, which could still be in it. I mean, just just look at it from my perspective. And, like, and I honestly, I never got to play... Metroid Prime Hunters, sadly, because I wanted to get it, but before when I was looking for it, I could never find it. I could either I could never find it or I could never find it at a decent price, because like people don't like to sell Nintendo games at cheaper prices for some reason. But that's as well beside the point. I'm looking forward to seeing what my Nintendo brings, but <clears throat> I, I think this would be a good move to make. I mean, there's not going to be a main met, mainline Metroid game on the Wii U. Coming to the Wii U, we know this. 
So putting the DS, porting the DS version of Metroid Prime Hunters to the Wii U, and putting it on the eShop for the Virtual Console, and putting it on the 3DS, which, like I said, if that if that minor if that thing is true for the for the my my Nintendo rewards, I would love to see that happen. And then you could have a ton of people actually playing and enjoying this game. And it would be it would be the aesthetic that people are interested in having for a Metroid game, even though I don't think Federation Force looks bad. I mean, it doesn't look great, to be honest, but I don't think it looks bad because it still has the same format. But that's just me. That this is that's really all I've had to say on it. Um thank you guys very much for listening. Keep your eyes and ears out for more of my stuff and until the next time, enjoy your games and peace out.